When lava meets the sea, what's going on in Iceland is, uh, in a way, is unique. Iceland has a special place uh, on the planet Earth's uh, crust. It is where the Atlantic Ocean is expanding and a new continent in the form of what we call Iceland is being created. Two continents, Eurasian plate and North American plate, there are the plates of the Earth crust. They are moving away from each other in Iceland. We know this because we have the evidence in the sea bottom, also on the land. We had earthquake over the last uh, several months in the uh, peninsula that the volcano is active. This is where the land cracks, where the land is extending from left to right and from north to south. And that relieves the pressure on the mantle of the earth. And when the pressure is removed, the mantle material, which is already uh, hot, can actually melt. You can see this in the presentation of the magma, which is boiling under the ground. It's as if we have removed the other material and looking down into the earth uh, without any obstruction. This is what was happened in this volcano. Uh, we saw a small volcano, then the flood of the lava started to build up. Uh, Big rivers, really big river, fast flowing, uh, molten uh, lava started to move and uh, flooding large areas uh, around it. The valleys first uh, around it were filled up, then now it's going to a lower valley and uh, flooding that area through three streams actually is doing it now. Some of them are really fast flowing, as you can see in this uh, video. And when they reach the sea, what will happen is that you look at it. Look, look. Uh, what you will see is that the lava flows into the ocean. The ocean doesn't have much effect on it, unless uh, it maybe creates some explosions, water uh, expands. Otherwise, it just uh, normally flows into the ocean, to the seawater and uh, as to the mass. What is more interesting is that it actually can create land. We have seen examples of this in the Hawaii, the land that has been created by the volcano, as you can see to the right side of this picture, uh, this uh, animation of the map. And uh, in Iceland, we have a similar situation. Uh, eruption has started um, to flood the area around the volcano, then all the other volcanoes became, uh, you know, uh, quiet. One started to grow bigger and bigger. And this is the one which actually is now responsible for most of the lava flow. If you look in the map of the Atlantic Ocean uh, sea bottom and, and Reykjanes Peninsula, you will see that uh, they actually uh, follow the pattern on this peninsula. Reykjanes Peninsula practically is extending east Ward and westward. Due to this uh, volcanism, the land is being spreading both ways. I go back to the same old uh, diagram which shows this, and that means it's getting longer. The mid Atlantic ridge is actually going right through this uh, Reykjanes Peninsula, creating uh, this uh, lava flows that we are taking samples here. And, uh, Add into the mass. And this peninsula, Reykjanes Peninsula, will become longer in the east west direction. And this lava, which you see now, will be solidified uh, and will add to the earth crust uh, lithosphere at the Reykjanes Peninsula of Iceland. It will become bigger.